Hello from Parsley Hill Spaniels. Spaniels have asked me to do a quick video with them going through our jungle on the west side. So we're going to be following our trails on the west side of our property. See if we can get through them. Madam Cheese there. There we are. So we're going to be going down Branston Boulevard onto Stilton Saunter and then we may do Bailey Boo de Bash and then we may do Swiss Switchback and Swiss Chicanes and then just come up the drive because believe it or not the sun's getting ready to set it's 20 past 10 at night it's July 8th and it's still 30 degrees outside, that's 30 degrees Celsius, which I think is around 88, 90 degrees Fahrenheit, so it's still a bit warm. It should go down to a cool 22, 23 degrees tonight, so. But anyway, we're not going to be out walking long because don't want the teddies to overheat, do we? As you can see, they're busy trying to trim everything up so that nothing looks out of place. There we go. Jesus up there. So here we go. Come on then. Let's go. Come on. I've still got hay fever. Come on, Gladys. Let's move. There we go. Oops. There we are. Come along. I managed to find out the names of some of these plants. I put an app on the phone to help the teddies. Those are Saskatoons. Obviously, they're not ripe yet, but they're Saskatoon, so which are like blueberries, but these are Saskatoon berries. I'm still in my shoe. Right. Oh, say shoe, it's a flip flop. There we go. Right. There we go. Cheesy there. So, this is Branston Boulevard coming down onto. Silt and Saunter. There we go. And it is a jungle <laughs> at the moment. Oops. Cheesy. There she goes. We just gotta be careful where we walk and how we walk. As you can see the teddies are exploring. They do like to explore. Have to get a bit of botany in. She's very good at it. She's gone off through there somewhere. Just see things moving. That's cheesy. Doing some secret work at the back there. There we are. Is that another tree down? We had a tree come down. We're just going to go and see. Is that taking the fence out? No. I don't think it has anyway. Sorry, just had to check and make sure that the fence wasn't down. It's another tree come down. We had some really high winds the other night. And they brought some trees down at the back of us from the ravine. So we had to make sure that they wasn't taking our, um, our fence down. Because obviously we don't want the teddies to get out and get hurt or anything. There we go. Some hazel. Just hazel trees there. We've got some hazel. I've actually got some nuts on. We're growing some nuts at the moment. That's willow, if you're interested. And we've got wild rose there. Clover. Wild raspberries. Come on in. There we go. Stinging nettles. Oh, I wish I could describe the smells of the evening here. They're gorgeous. Absolutely lovely. It's almost like a herbal tea. I know that sounds silly, but that's what it smells like anyway. It smells like to me. Obviously my nose and smell is not as good as the teddies. They can smell so much more. Anyway, as you can see, it really is a jungle. <laughs> Look. 
some hogweed there. Normal hogweed, not giant hogweed. Look at those trees. Bushes. So different from two months ago in May when everything was just coming in. And now we're at the start of July. It's a jungle. Just a big jungle. Look at that. The teddies love it. Can you see? Boogie Mama. Not sure if you can hear the peeping in the background. If you can, that's a woodpecker. It's a downy woodpecker making that noise. What are you eating? Is that your answer to everything, isn't it? Sniff it, pee on it, walk away. Yeah. Eric's answer to life. Ah, oh, there we are. That. Can you see it? It's a hazelnut growing. Isn't that lovely. Some more there. Bring this down. There you go. That's what hazelnuts look like when they're growing. Sometimes they're double, sometimes they're even triple, they're a triple one. Try and get this in focus. Awful, I can see it. I can't get it on here. There we go. Oh, that's a snooze. There we are. Triple one. There you go. There. Come on, then. path up there is the continuation of Stilton Saunter and this one down here is Bailey Buda Bash so we'll go down here and that one that just went past me is Gladys off on an urgent miss mission somewhere more hazelnuts Cows in the background as well. Still a jungle. Lovely evening walk. So lucky because the, the sun doesn't set until about half past ten, quarter to eleven at night, and it tends to set in the northwest this time of year, which is lovely. So we're not quite high enough up, that's cheesy, not quite high enough up to uh, be in the Arctic Circle so we get the midnight sun, but we do get about 19 hours a day of sun, which isn't too bad, is it? That just gets me up at silly o'clock in the morning, because Eric. Especially if it's about 2.30, you can see the dawn just starting. It's lovely. There we go. What have we got here? Eric, what are you up to? I can hear Boogie. Come on, let's go find a boogie cheesy. There's an Adelaide. Gladys, ah, there you are, Miss Boogie. Just come back from doing whatever she was going to do. I think somebody new has moved in because I can hear a dog I'm not used to hearing. 
in the distance, so I'm guessing probably about 12 acres away, which is four lots. There's a Swiss in there. There he is. Right. Yeah, you were on Swiss switchback, weren't you? Things landing on me. There we go. Come on, we'll go back up the drive now. That was our little jungle on that side. There we go. Come on then, up we go. We'll go up the drive. Come on, off you go. No, we're not going down there. Not going down mustard meander, it's too warm. The colour of that sky, how lovely. The sun hasn't set yet. Close to it, not yet. It's just down the other side of those trees. Leave that alone. Come on, up we go. And there we are. That's an evening walk through our jungle on the west side, following some of our trails. So until next time, hope everybody stays happy and healthy and enjoys the summer or winter if you're on the southern hemisphere. Obviously northern hemisphere we're in our summertime. I hope you all enjoy yourself, stay healthy, get yourselves vaccinated. That helps. And we can all get back to some sort of normality, which would be lovely. So, anyway, until next time, ta from Parsley Hill Spaniels.